Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. My name is Weasel. We are in Weasel Wonderworld, where things are looking pretty sweet, actually. A um, little bit of lit and vomit, but our park rating is slowly but steadily going up. We just built a mini golf course. Yes, we did that. Um, I hope they have good maintenance. I have a hard time believing that that stuff falls apart. I mean, I'm just going to hope it's going to be fine and it's not breaking. Then again, there might, there's a lot of moving parts in here. Who knows? Anyways. Capacity unlimited. That's very good. Actually, yeah. Do they even have to wait at all? Or can they just keep walking in? I mean, the continuous stream of people. Eh, probably a continuous stream of people will work just fine. But just in case, I will put down a waiting TV monitor. Where is it? The waiting TV thing. Q in line. There you go. Oh, wait. This one makes more sense. God, so much flashing. It's, it's horrible. Uh, put some things down. Anyway, what I wanted to build is some booths to sell more food and drinks. Uh, we got a chicken stand. Yes, let us sell some chicken. Bask in the glorious legs of chickens. We're gonna add chili. Make it nice and spicy. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, it's gonna be super spicy. They have no choice. And they can have much, as much of it as they like. Uh, I'm gonna ramp it up a little bit. Uh, 30 cents each. 380, 480. And, yep. 3 and 4, not hungry, whatever. I mean, that's also a thing. They might just not be hungry because there's so much other stuff yet. But, who knows? They might get it later. Uh, where was I? Right. Uh, also, we have a pizzeria now. Oh, let me, let me synchronize. Yes, it's synchronized. A pizzeria. Guess we're not gonna put more food down here. But over here. Absolutely more food. It's gonna be like, you know what? If, if you're not selling enough, not hungry, not hungry, not hungry. If, if that is not selling enough, we might as well put it over on the other side. Oh, well. Uh, pizzeria. What else do we have? Something new? No, it was just chicken. All right, I'm gonna put the chicken booth over here. Uh, let's, a second chicken booth, why not? And some drinks in the middle. Okay, turn them on. Turn them on, and over here we're gonna have to set some things. Uh, hot chilies, lots of them on there. I wanna make sure that they want some water. Yes, chilies on all of them. What's that? Uh, pineapple, sure. Pineapple on. No, let's not put pineapple on anything. I, I guess we could turn it on and allow them to put it on if they're that disgusting to put pineapple on a pepperoni. I, I guess pepperoni and pineapple could work. I always think of pineapple with ham. And again, it's also a little bit disgraceful for pizza. Okay, uh, we need some park lamps. Uh, the gentle white noise of a waterfall. Oh, nice. I think it's kind of nice. Okay, squeeze you over here, remove these guys, thank you. And it's time to build another uh, attraction, I feel. This is uh, looking good so far. This is a solid piece of park. Solid chunk of park. Let's zoom out a little bit. Oh, it looks... Yeah, it looks very nice. From the outside. From high up. Alright. How about we build the... Actually, did we get anything new? Just want to make sure. No, it doesn't look like it. If I get the... Ooh, Space Arcade. Large undercover video games arcade. Oh, it's like alien. It's like sci-fi. But it's an arcade that is really cool. There's nothing wrong with an arcade at all. Maybe we can have like a super small sci-fi section somewhere. Um, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't mind putting that here, maybe. Just on the outskirts. Not a big sci-fi fan, so... Yeah, let's let's do that. Let, let, let us do that. Let us put some sci-fi here in the corner. I say we shall do that. Oh, do we have metal gates yet? Marble. Ah, uh, we don't have metal. Oh, that's a that's a bummer. That would be really required for some good old um sci-fi setting. Hey, we'll get some later. Okay. One buck and yeah, you know what? One one path here will 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 be enough, I guess. We do a double one. Yeah, I guess why not? Double on both sides. I guess it's not going to be sci-fi after all. And again, let's see what we have. We have we, we could put some animatronics here and make it sci-fi, even if it's just asphalt. 
here. That robot greets you as you walk in. The robot over here, dancing, loading robot. A Martian war machine, sure. What, what makes it Martian though, because it's green? I guess having some path lamps makes sense. Oh, they don't fit on the path? That's awkward. Oh well. UFO tech animatronic. Sure, you know what? Let's let's put that here too. Are there like oh yeah, right, there are some uh, sci-fi trees and carnivorous lilies. Hydroponics Bride of Zeus. Man, those are some... Those are some cool names for plants. It's not... Oh, Lily. No. It is the Hydroponics Bride of Zeus. Digging it. But yeah, makes it all look a little sci-fi-y. So much decoration. Just for a little bit of sci-fi. That's, that's how serious I am about my sci-fi. Come here, everything's crazy. Okay, this doesn't fit here. Martian Tiger Lotus. Neptune Spore Pod. Spore Pod. Philosophy Tree. The Venusian Spore Pod. The Winged Rapture. Okay, let's let's just say this is sci-fi now. Here, here's your little sci-fi corner. Let's see if people like the arcade. I want to go on something more thrilling than the arcade. Hope isn't a really good value. Well, they'll come around. They'll come around. By the way, time to put some information booths down. Uh, we have some at the start, but I feel we would. Mm, it would be smart to maybe put some, distribute some all over the place, just in case people need an umbrella or a map that they didn't buy at the entry because they're silly, and then they're like, "Oh man, I'm lost." You know, the usual. Looking good. Uh, people are waiting to get their turn here. Oh, it's so dark. You can't play. You can play that at night. That doesn't work like that. Give me some beautiful lamps. Do we have some other ones? Maybe like Wonderland, prehistoric. Not really. Atlantis. That isn't really what I'm looking for. Generic is fine. Passport machine. What is a passport machine? I actually have no idea. Oh, is it for because it's in the swimming expansion? I'll I'll put one down. I guess it doesn't do a whole lot. People are still using it. Oh no, chair swing had to make a stop. Worst. I'm so happy that just nobody dies. That's already pretty awesome. Anyway, I wanted to put some lamps down. It's Let's get back to the lamps. Not lose focus here. Okay. Uh, park path lamp. Park street lamp. Oh, I can only put them on paths though. I need something else. I need something that I can put standing somewhere. Oh, only path lamps. Come on. Don't be like that. Give me something I can place even though. Hmm. I don't think I see any... Nope. These can be placed wherever I like. Good. And let's do that, please. Get rid of one of the trees. Put them here. Put them below there. Okay, very good. So they don't have to play in the darkness anymore. Very important. An octopus... Fa oh, wow. Would you check out that octopus fountain? That is some serious octopus fountain right there. You know what? I don't mind this. Let's get rid of my sign. Let's put a nice big octopus fountain here. This looks so cool. Let's put a path around it. So people get to enjoy the whole thing. A little bit more. Uh, one distance. There you go. That is too cool. Octopus fountain. That is now the centerpiece of this thing. And maybe some trees and bushes around it. Sorry, I'm 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 totally in the decorative mood right now. Give me Oh yes. I'm gonna put some large flower beds all around this. 
I never really spent too much time decorating my other parks, so I'm, I think that's kind of nice. And to protect those, we're going to put some small hedges around it. Or, or around like this. Yeah, that'll, that'll be fine. All hail the octopus. That is really nice. Yeah, why not? Wish I could switch up those uh, flowers a little bit. I th Wait a second. I think I can. I promise you we're going to go... There you go. I can rotate them a little bit. For what it's worth. Yeah, it doesn't really make it look different. Makes me feel better. All right. Cool. We got the giant octopus. Happy about that. Happy about that. We have a little bit of extra cash. Good. Let's build some more attractions. Uh, and let's invest some more into research. We're like, we have 60 research. And I would like some gentle rides and some thrill rides. A little bit more effort into that. These are all pretty crazy. Bumper boats, chair swing. How about the, the top spin? That sounds pretty cool to me. I guess over here is fine. Mm. Yeah, make them so people can see it as they walk down the path. Entrance over here, exit over here. Oh, very well. Very happy with that. And since we have a little bit of extra cash, I might run some advertisement. Okay, anyways. Oh, right. A first eight booth. Let's, let's do that, shall we? Let's be... Reasonable and put a first aid booth somewhere. Um, I figure the roller coaster is the most intense thing we have, so putting it somewhere within the vicinity of this, not a bad idea. Here you go. Build the paths around it, turn that thing on. And of course, don't forget the trash bins. Ooh, benches. Also a very good idea. For the others, if they're waiting outside. Ah, oh, we don't have any trash benches, uh, bins over there. And judging from the amount of trash that I'm seeing here and there, I think we might need another... Um, we need some cleaning personnel. Let's hire another janitor, shall we? All right, buddy, you're going places. Or is he going to be a trained? And I think I'm going to get another mechanic as well. I feel that's a good plan. Wonderful. Ooh, 555 people already in this small park. This is going to be... Yeah, we're going to have no problem with 2,000 people. Wow. Matt, imagine the cash money we're going to make. New attraction, Rocket Boost Cantina. Uh, that is sci-fi. Sci-fi which fits really well over here with all the other sci-fi stuff. So yeah, guess what we're building? We're building the sci-fi cantina. Cantina. Right over here. Go and sell some rocket fuel, space juice, nebula juice, constellation crush. Yeah, sell all that stuff. Little sci-fi area. I genuinely will, um change the path though as soon as we have this uh the proper metal path do we have it now no we we'll get there eventually no. arcade isn't doing too hot though now that i'm looking at it i mean it's making a little bit of money but people are not crazy about it how do i get more people to walk into here i guess we could run an advertisement just for it space arcade one I wanted to run an advertisement anyway. For free attractions. National newspaper. Space Arcade. Where is it? Space Arcade. Four weeks. It's not going to make us a whole lot of money, but it might make this thing more popular. At least that's my hope. Oh, for a second I thought it looked like, like the Pip-Boy interface or so. <laughs> How many people can this hold? 12 people on ride. Hmm. I guess since they're not seeing the entrance, 
That might make it even more tricky for them. Hmm. To walk into here. Anyway, the tops- Oh, I totally forgot to turn on- Thank you. I totally forgot to turn on the top spin. Here you go. Totally did not turn that on. Worst, Weasel. Worst. I think I already made it pricey. I'm gonna make 250. 250. And how about. Hmm. I wonder what design that should be. It could just be Wonderland or so. Yeah, we don't need to, to do anything. Wow! That thing got immediately super long and full. Well, I guess there's a super long waiting line now. I mean, there's a lot of people that can ride on that thing. Um, I mean, that initial interest might wean off fairly soon. Let's put a bench here. And, of course, QTV line monitors, because they might actually have to wait a little bit here. Oh, I can't put seats inside the waiting queue. Ah, uh, yes. If you've been waiting for a while, that's just... That's just nice of me, I guess. That is just nice of me. So we can put in a QTV line. Oh, the, the arcade break? Let's not do that while we're advertising it. Let's do it every 20 minutes. Just to be on the safe side here. Coupons for free attraction are finished. Okay, good to know. Alright. I want to just make sure the swinging inverter ship. Something else that's really cool. Not a water ride yet. Oh, Disco. That's, that's from um, the water expansion. Splash. Soaked. Soaked. That's the word. Soaked. Alright, where are we going to put you, though? You know what? We're gonna have to find out what we're gonna do with this on the mountain here. I have no idea what I'm gonna do with the mountain. Should we build something up here, I wonder? We could have a path that walks... Nah, let's let's not waste a space here. I wouldn't mind... I guess I could throw it over here. Yeah, why, why not? Why not? That's good. Put the exit over here. And rinse over here. I hope that is going to make us lots more of cash monies. Wait, 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 wait. It should. Oh, can... Oh, this... <laughs> that is actually really cool. This looks really neat. When it goes under the other one. I mean... I, I think it looks cool. Don't you judge. Gonna have to put a lot of bushes down around here to make this look nice again. But for now, we just want the attractions to attract more people into the park and make more monies. That looks pretty neat, though, doesn't it? Sure, let's go ahead and put some small hedges around this. Just for good measure. You can probably put some nice decorations in between here, too. Eh, it doesn't fit there, it's okay. Too much. Well, I hope I win some award of some sort by putting all of these bushes here. Nicest looking park ever! How neat is that? Okay, we have 655 people already in here. Um, chances are, I mean, if this is going at that speed, we're gonna, we're gonna hit... Entrepreneur in no time. It's 1,200. We're still a little bit away of there. Um, and don't worry, once we reach Tycoon, we're still probably going to play, depending how big the park is. I want to fill up this whole area with as much park as possible. I don't even think you can buy more land around this. Can you? Hmm. Attractions, guest challenges. Scenario objectives. By the way, that reminds me. Since this park is doing so well now, how about we ask for some cash monies and do run an advertisement and see how much people are willing to pay. National newspaper, out oh, its attraction voucher, uh, free admission, ad campaign for park. Let's do that. National newspaper, when I want to run that, six weeks. A little pricey maybe, but that will give me an indication of how much people are willing to pay to enter the park. Come on, guys. 
Get in. Alright. Five bucks. Still bringing a lot of peeps. I might just set it to 10 and see what happens. I mean, they're definitely not going to turn around. They're still going to go in. But since we don't have ATMs yet... Oh, we have coffee now. Since we don't have ATMs yet, it doesn't make a lot of sense. Yeah, let's keep it at 10 bucks. Let's let's see what happens with 10 bucks. This number might go down. But for now, I'm actually pretty happy with this. Coffee. Man, we finally have a coffee booth. A coffee stand. I'll sell some coffee over here. And I will sell some coffee. I figure over here. We'll need another toilet, though. We will... Over here, maybe... Yeah, why not over here? Attract some people. Um, I will definitely want to bring more people over. Can I set the amount of toppings for each stall individually? No, okay, it's also synced. Good. Okay, where are we going to put the toilet? This toilet is making us handsomely rich. Well, really rich. 300 per hour, that's great. Yeah, let's build a second one. Um, so we have one over here. Yeah, I guess over here isn't the worst idea, like in between the sci-fi. Any new paths, gonna have to replace that at one point. Here, more toilets. Turn it on, 50 cents. And give me all the silly sci-fi decoration you can give me. Um, here you go. God, those plants, real plants like that would really freak me out. Really looks like a different planet. Then again, it's called a Martian Tiger Lotus. I assume they're just props. Let's put the winged raptor there. I figure what we can... Uh, I figure what we can do is put some benches down. Um, space spin. <laughs> Worst sci-fi movie ever. Ah, star glow of lamp, uh, glow lamps. One over here, one over here. Ah, uh, too bright. God, it's horrible. The blinking is so horrible. I would hate a park like that, honestly. I just have it less, more subtle. I guess, I guess that's the most subtle we can get this year. Oops, my bad. I'm gonna put some animatronics here as well. Martian War Machine. If that if that doesn't get the juices flowing, and a little rocket ship. Adorbs. God, it's so loud. Oh man, so much vomiting. That is no good. No bueno. I guess there was. Oh yeah, there was something happening that made them all vomit. And these guys are just standing in there. Why are you just standing in the vomit? What's wrong with you? And some space benches. Looks like total regular bench, but yeah, it's a space bench. Ooh, small hovering sign. What, what, what are we gonna write on that sign? How about... Hold your breath, because space or... Nah, I mean, it doesn't make sense. I have nothing. Martians rule! <laughs> we can have, we could use that for no entry, but for now, I'm, I'm happy with this. This is looking good. This is looking good. Um, plenty of cash. We can probably start paying back some of our loans here. Um, but yeah, I think we should build a roller coaster in the ne next episode. We only have one roller coaster, and for a roller coaster tycoon, that is pretty sad. Yeah, I would love to see another one. We'll have to take care of a little bit more of decorations in here. But for now, I'll gladly put down some more food places, like hot dogs. You can never have enough hot dog stands, can you? And just some break. Ah, we have some drinks over there. Over here. No, I think I'm good. I think I'm good. We could put some over here later, but nobody's walking there anyway. Uh, how happy are people with this? Oh, they're, they're gonna wait a ton of time here. And also, they don't see anything because... Reasons. Here, let's put some lamps down. And TV line monitors. Good. Progress was made. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like. 
Again, let me know your ideas for what do we build this one, the disco, I think, and well, if you if you like and have a name for a space toilet, please, please don't hold back. Let me know. Um, I'm gonna have to start naming them soon. Uh, I will probably do that off camera. And yeah, in any case, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like. I'm Weasel. I'm out and hope to see you around. Bye bye.